but was saying, I want to teach you how to be able to reflect and churn. A very simple example that Baba's given. When Baba says, Swadarshan Chakradhari, long, long Hindi word, and it's not a word that somebody out there who speaks Hindi would know. Um, it's very much spiritual language, and it comes up within the scriptures, of course, but as I say, people don't have any connection with that word or any sense of what it means. But swear the self, darshan, to see, and chakra, to see the self through the whole cycle. Now, what would that mean to anybody out there? Uh, they'd get stuck. But Baba's explained very much how the soul has gone through the cycle, and Baba's explained the whole cycle. But Baba's saying that when somebody doesn't have the practice of churning, then they'll go through the cycle, golden age, the rage, copper age. <laughs> you can do it in 30 seconds, or you can actually go into the depth of it, not just a few minutes, but really, what is all this about? How does it apply to me? And so, Baba's saying, ask yourself four questions. And if you apply this to every single aspect of Baba's knowledge, you'll be able to imbibe it in your life, but also you'll be able to use the power that this gives to deal with whatever obstacles come in front of you. You'll find that the power of the knowledge is able to help you go above, and you won't get stuck with an obstacle anywhere. So the first question to ask yourself about any of the points of knowledge that you hear from, especially from Sakar Murlis, because the Sakar Murlis carry the body of the knowledge. The 18 chapters of the Gita are in the Sakar Murli. And Shiv Baba had said this when Shiv Baba came first on the 21st of January, 1969. Baba said, the 18 chapters of the Gita have been explained, but it's time for you to revise and apply all of these. And of course, Brahma Baba had applied everything, and so he became a Vyak. And then it's been through the years we've seen all the Dadis fly away, and it's because they were applying all of this to get to their own final complete stage. And now, all of us still remain, and we'll be able to become avyakt as we apply all of this. So the first question is, go into the depth of knowledge and see what is the significance of this. Just see, where is this taking me? What does it actually mean? And then the second is, at what time do I apply it? And then the third is, what method should I use to apply it? 